Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to Brass Monkey X and welcome to another episode of What's in the Box. Um, so I know this is like my fourth What's in the Box episode in a row. I promise my next video will not be a What's in the Box. I got some more stuff coming up. Um, but today I just finished my workout. Amazon just dropped this off. Um, I had no clue that this product that I ordered was going to be this big. This box is massive for some ungodly reason. I don't know why. I thought the product that I ordered was smaller than this. So I'm over here on my uh, woodworking bench because it wouldn't fit on the gunsmithing bench. Um, I mean, I could have put it over there, but it was too big. I couldn't even frame up the shot. So we're over here today taking a look. Um, but let me get this cut open and hopefully the box inside of here is a little bit smaller. Cool. Looks like it's just a lot of packing material. Wow. All right. Or there isn't even a box in here. It's just the product. So, let me get this gigantic box out of the way here. Hold on one second. All right. So, what are we looking at here, guys? This is the Gun Butler. By Tipton Gun Cleaning Supplies. Um, I just wanted a way where I could hold up my rifles on my gunsmithing bench when I'm doing work on them or cleaning them. I needed a third hand. All right, Sometimes two hands just isn't enough. So I picked this up. You can put your cleaning supplies in here. Small parts, spare parts, whatever you're working on. Um, it's got this little handle here. You can carry it around if you need to. Um, I wouldn't really use it as like a bench rest. It's more of like a cleaning maintenance kind of thing to, like I said, just give you like a third hand, help you hold things when you can't. Um, let me see. Ah, oh, they got this thing strapped down. Hold on, let me cut this open. Get that out of there. Try and get this assembled for you here. See how this works. I have no clue how these come out of here. tab there push that little tab in I don't know here I'll try and show you if you look down in there there's a little tab holding them in place I guess that's for storage purposes when you're not using it but I'm probably never gonna put them back in there you just put these right in here like this and your rifle just sits right here um again I don't have a rifle down here I do have a uh, hold on a second There we go. I do have an old paintball gun. This will work as a stand-in for now just to show you. But your rifle just sits down in there like that so you can basically holds your work up for you while you're doing whatever you got to do to it to clean it or maintain it or what have you. But uh, yeah, nothing too fancy. Um, I paid $27.99 for this, so just under $30. Bucks. Again, got it on Amazon like most of the products I get. But, uh, yeah, it should hold up. It's, I mean, it's, it's made out of plastic. It, it, it's nothing, nothing to write home about, but it should do the job. These are pretty sturdy. The handles here for holding up the work. So we'll see. It, it, it should be fine. So you're probably going to see this in a few more videos. Anytime I'm working on rifles now, I'm going to have this set up. So, uh, but that's what I got for you. And again, guys, I promise, don't worry. My next video will not be another what's in the box. I mean, I know you guys love this format. You're all about watching me open up my mail. I mean, who wouldn't want to watch me do that? But don't worry. Like I said, next video coming up is going to be awesome. You guys are going to like it. But uh, thanks for tuning in, guys. I appreciate you watching, and we'll catch you next time.